Hello guys. Oh, let's turn it down a little bit. I've just finished setting up. I didn't think you'd want to see it again. Uh, I'm doing a, a Christmas company a corporate Christmas party. That was a long title, but that sort of thing. Um, they're coming to eat at half past seven. It's 20 past six now. And uh, I've been told by the manageress that, you know, they probably won't really want to get up and dance until sort of half nine. So I can't imagine, even she said, you can't imagine them dancing till midnight. So uh, that's when I'm finishing. So it'll be a little bit afterwards. We'll wait and see. So it should be quiet. I don't know if you're going to see. Again, apologies on the camera. It's going to be sorted out soon. Don't worry about that. New camera on its way. I've done this before. Court Lodge Hotel, Wokingham. And I have done one. There's a couple of gig logs, but it's a different setup tonight. And it really is a minimal one. I need to get and I want to remind you of uh, something that I did tell you mobile DJs to do and that's when you turn up at a gig in a hotel and you normally get there a few hours early like tonight they're having a dinner and a dance uh, so the dinner I mean it's I don't know it's uh, quarter to seven they're not due to turn up until perhaps half past seven sorry there's a kettle boiling here <laughs> so we'll let that boil away because a cup of tea as you know is very important as a steam comes on the lens Look at that, that's ridiculous. Okay, <laughs> we'll try that again. Um, so, uh, I finished up packing the stuff, the manager is walking around, and uh, I just went up to the reception and said, ah, the manager normally lets me have a room to change and, and relax before the gig. No problem, sir, here's the keys. Okay, I haven't got the greatest room in the world, but... Tea and coffee? I bought a bit of uh, lunch, so I can, I've got somewhere to have my sandwiches. I've got the use of, uh, use of a rather old-fashioned bathroom, but I have got it. Even if I wanted a little kip, I could have a, have a nice little sleep. But what I'm going to do is have my sandwiches, a nice cup of tea, watch the television. So, you go in. Oh, well, I'll walk around with you for a little bit. And uh, the other thing... Uh, really is what am I going to do tonight now they've said oh we're probably not going to dance older people perhaps you know mixture we don't know what they're going to be like to there here there's not that many probably about 30 30 odd perhaps 40 we'll see exactly um what am I going to do well at the moment I'm mixing Christmas and and some like Michael Bublé and Frank Sinatra and, and stuff like that it's just going on Mixmeister that's why they're going to um, why they're eating I'm going to carry on with that uh, I'll probably just repeat it again, to be honest. Um, and we'll probably start off with, um, I don't know, a bit of Motown to start with. Um, see if that gets them in the mood. Uh, I will be doing some 60s, 70s. And I'm going to do some little sets, you know, perhaps three songs. See what tickles their fancy, see what uh, floats their boat. Um, if there's some youngsters there, well, you know, I will uh, put some chart stuff on, I'll put some dark stuff on. We, you know, it's one of these things that you uh, get to know, um, but it will be a lot of standard stuff. Now, the manager says she will be very surprised if it goes on until midnight, probably 11 o'clock by the time, so only a couple of hours. But when they say that, they'll probably all be drunk and all be dancing and wanting more at 12, so you can never tell. And well, we'll see. I'm going to relax for an hour, and uh, then you'll see the gig, all the stuff, where I turn the lights on. past nine they're still eating they've just finished the main course they've still got pudding and coffees at half past nine and I go on until midnight so should we say half an hour that means it's going to be a two hour gig max that's going to be dead easy now at the moment I'm watching a bit of TV so sometimes it's easy it's lucky the hotel is uh, very friendly and warm for these Christmas gigs and uh, depending on how formal, sometimes I wear a suit, just a normal lounge suit, sometimes, you know, just uh, trousers and shirt, but uh, it does depend. Uh, really, I'm waffling away, just trying to fill up this gig rock. <laughs> Nothing's happening yet. <laughs>
wake up in a city that doesn't sleep and find I'm king of the hill, top of the heap. Is there? It's up to you. So from me, Jason Early, thanks for being a great crowd. Take care. Enjoy the rest of the weekend. Thank you and good night. tonight uh, 40 minutes to pack away because of the reduced amount of uh, equipment I'm not putting the camera on myself because it's so dark in here you won't see anything so there's nothing else you can see the uh, the road ahead of me uh, again apologize about the camera that is going to be rectified very very soon uh, it's just deciding which camera to get to be honest with you um, anyway where was I uh, using just twin speakers and an amp, uh, mix my stuff all night, so that's the second gig. Only one little mistake on that and it was fine and that was just an MP3 was running too fast, sorry too slow for some reason, God knows what that was. Um, but they were all sort of women of a certain age and uh, that suits me to be honest with you, I do like a woman of a certain age. Um, good Christmas party, by the time I got there I only had about an hour and a half um, to do. They had their own quiz sorted out, they had uh, announcements and uh, that was it really. So, uh, you know, it was a good hour and a half though, so they all went away happy. Um, nothing else to tell you, just another sort of Christmassy gig. I didn't play any Christmas songs though, they weren't really keen on that and uh, it's not quite near enough uh, uh, to Christmas yet. Uh, what are we? I don't even know the date. 12th. And uh, now we're into the 13th of uh, December. So next week, when I've got another gig log, uh, I'll probably be playing a few more Christmas songs. Uh, what else? Oh, it should be interesting next week. I'm doing a place I've never done before, and I'm doing the restaurant area, and they, that's the one they've said, uh, very small low gig. So, straightforward. Got the room, remember that. Um, background music. Nice and easy, you know, ABBA, uh, Love Shack, Shout, all the normal stuff. And uh, they went away happy, I got a round of applause at the end. They were all on the dance floor at the end. And uh, the manageress was happy, so if the manageress is happy, that would go back to the agency, the agency would be happy. So another one in the bank. Thanks for watching, as always. We're going to have some new look uh, gig logs in the new year and uh, my YouTube site will be updated. Um, that's from me for the moment, Jason Early. Take care of yourself, practice and enjoy.